So if you're a beginning editor of this community and you want to learn a little bit more about Sony Vegas and how to do effects or anything, I have got a playlist right down here in the main of my channel and then you go to press Sony Vegas tutorials and there should be a playlist of all of my tutorials I have done in the past. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys later. Yo what's up guys it's Joker here coming with another tutorial today. As you can see guys we're going to be learning how to do cartoon movement text. It should be on your screen right now what I mean. So that is the cartoon movement text. I'm going to show you properly as well again on this kind of Sony Vegas when I showed you guys that edit in your lover. So you guys have requested me this kind of effect in those comments so I was like do you know what no one really has done this so I will show you guys how to do it. It's really really easy there's only two plugins you got to have but you have to download red giant plugins i'll be getting that in a minute but this is what i mean you guys want to learn your lover you saw that guy um on the screen earlier so i don't know why i keep saying it so anyway guys you want to go in the description i have put a download link of red giant plugins 1.6 so what you want to do you want to download that it should be only about 500 mb i think anyway so what we're going to do is open this up and then drag this red giant folder down. Right, okay, so what you want to do is double click this and then basically you're going to have three of these. You don't want to mess with these two at all. You don't really want to mess with them. I don't know why, but you need those two to activate this one. I don't know why, but that's how it works and the person who made it. But anyway, guys, um, you want to double click this one and then all you want to do is drag that down here. Okay, so it's going to be looking like that. You want to close these down, whatever. But before you do anything to press this, you want to close down your Sony Vegas and anything like AE or anything what is part of Universe. So once you turn everything off, so now you want to double click this and press Universe Setup. My one's still open because I've already downloaded Universe, but I'll show you guys how to install it. So uh, it's going to come up with an administrator kind of thing, a uh, user account control, but just press yes. Um, and then we'll come up with kind of like a Russian and kind of thing. I don't even know what this language is But you want to press this so now there's a detector my Vegas is open and It's already had it, but once you press that it will be downloading all your plugins for red giant anyway So that's all you have to do and then you press finish when it goes on I'm just gonna get off that because that does mess up my plugins if I do install it <laughs> But anyway guys you want to go back on your Sony Vegas anyway you want to open it back up sorry and then you I'm going to show you guys properly now how to get it so what you want to do guys is go to media generators and then go to legacy text or go on the top of here where it says insert text where media wherever it is so uh, let's put um, I don't know tutorial okay let's put tutorial okay let's put about here and then I don't know let's just go choose some just um Let's get that. Okay, let's get that's all right. Okay, <laughs> we don't know. Um, I don't know the cleaner one. I, I don't even know. But any kind of font that would be all right with you guys. So um, anyway, let's delete that. Press S, delete that. Okay, so we got the tutorial kind of thing. Anyway, do you want to go to the effects panel or video event effects? So once you go on here, you should have a kind of in the middle of your FX thing. You should have kind of like you. You can find glitch and all this stuff, like the ones what are like really easy to see. So what you want to do is you want to download, well not down, sorry, you want to add the Holo Matrix, press add, and also you want to add ripples or anything like kind of wave effect or anything like that. So just add and then put that over that side actually, and then press OK. You have, you must have this on the left. Okay, so let's turn off Holo Matrix in a moment. Okay, let's do Ripple. So the Ripple is horrible now at the moment, okay? So what you want to do is mess around with the speed animation and then the amplitude or aspect or I don't know, whatever. But um, uh, that's really, really high. Okay, so it should just like ripple. I don't know how, like what my setting was last time. But um, it should just ripple like that or anything. Just do any kind of ripple or anything. This is not the best, but anyway. <laughs> Alright, so what you want to do now is go to the Hollow Matrix. So um, once you do that, just turn that on actually. It will go to like a weird kind of like um, this kind of color. You don't really want that at all. So what you want to do is um, turn that off. So what you want to do is go down here, just turn that off. 
and then turn that off and then turn that off and then turn just turn all of these off it will just it will it's just part of it i don't know why and then um it's just like an effect hollow matrix you guys can find out what it actually is if you want to keep um investigating but anyway guys um let's go up here and then what you want to do here is just mess around with uh this the frame rate so what i did is because it's 30 fps I, I put it down to 15 so that's half the fps so what's going to happen is it's just going to go with the fps it is going to go with so now it's like really really jittery so when you play it it's kind of like that now and if you put it down to like maybe 8 or 10 whatever it is uh, let's just re let's pre-render it now um, So let you can see it's like really slow, but once you play it it looked like a kind of like a cartoon effect like this So that is how you do it guys It's really really easy if you get the right settings for the ripple, but the hollow matrix That's all you need to just mess around with the FPS but that's it. So that is how you do the cartoon movement text. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Please leave a like. It really helps me out, guys, to motivate myself to go do more videos and everything. So please leave a like and leave a comment, kind of like what other tutorials you want. Please don't say tutorials on like what's already been done. Please investigate it. If not, um, if it's not done, that'll be really, really handy, and you know I can try and make a tutorial. So hope you guys enjoyed, and leave a like, and peace out. Wake me up, wake me up inside. I can't wake up.